Hello, welcome back to KTV. Today I am going to do an everyday makeup routine. This is something that I do whenever I'm going to work or whenever I feel like actually putting on makeup but I don't want to go all out. I just want to do something very simple. Bronzy eye look, bronzy face. Now that we're in summer, I really like that vibe. So yes. We'll see because I really want it to be this. I wanted, I wanted this video to be like a no makeup makeup look. But as you can see, they say no makeup makeup look. So that video will come on, on a later later. So it just ended up being my everyday makeup routine. If you want to know how to create this bronzy look or just want to know how I do it for some reason whatsoever, I enjoy seeing people putting on makeup so maybe you do too. Anyways, thank you so much for being here and watching all my videos. If you do, if you're not, if you're new, well, hi, my name is Camille and I am a person who does videos for not a living but for fun. So enjoy and keep on watching. All right, so what we're gonna do today, as I previously mentioned, I'm going to do my no makeup makeup look, which consists of no foundation. I rarely wear foundation, honestly. Thing is, I have really small freckles here. They're rarely noticeable, but I really like them. So I feel like whenever I put on foundation, the most of the, 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 most of the ones I have are like full cut medium to full coverage and it just it hides them and I don't like it. I'm just gonna start. Let's just do this. I'm gonna do a little thing. Mm, awesome. We're gonna start with some moisturizer. I am currently using ponds for dry skin because my skin is pretty dry. Although the only I only I have like combination skin because it's a little bit oily around here, the T-zone. I like drown myself in there. I think I took too much. <sighs> mm. What? Dun, 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 dun. I prefer more of like the dewy look rather than the matte look. There we go. I'm just gonna let that sink and like set on my skin so it's not like too tacky. How is that gonna help? Moisturizers in. I'm going to take my primer, my Smashbox Photo Finish Foundation Primer. I'm not putting on foundation, but I still put it on the places where I'm going to put on my concealer because it's the only thing that I wear. And I don't know. I like putting it because if I don't, I feel like I don't have a base. So I just put it around my T zone. Now that my face is primed and moisturized and it feels amazing, we're going to start with some eyebrows. I'm going to do the eyebrows first. I'm going to do them really lightly. I use this eyebrow pencil. This is from actually a brow kit that came with this and some scissors from Walgreens. Studio 35 Beauty hooking you up. Yes, I really like it, it's really good. And the spoolie is like on point. All right, so we're just gonna brush them up. I look like, what's the name? Some kind of person in a movie. If you can think of that person, <laughs> let me know. Okay, so we're finally done with the brows. What I'm gonna do now is I'm going to apply concealer on the rest of the areas that I wanna highlight, and pretty much I'm just gonna do it lightly here, just because I have these like, this discol not discoloration, but like, you know what I mean. I'm taking the Tarte Shape Tape in the color Light Neutral. And a little bit of this goes a long way, so I'm literally going to dot this here, 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 and here, and here. That is it. So I got my sleeve all the way up trying to dampen this thing. And also, it is very disgustingly dirty. I 
them highlighted. I'm gonna take with the same sponge, some air spun real quick. I'm just gonna take this much. So check this out. I don't have a, a I don't have a viewfinder. So if you see me looking this way, that's my version of a viewfinder, which is me looking at the mirror. The I look at the mirror and I see the camera's reflection of what it's videotaping. <laughs> So we're just gonna let this sit in. While we let this sit in, we're gonna play with our eyes. Since I'm trying to go with a natural, I am going to use a little bit of bronzer in my eye and that is it. My current favorite bronzer that I probably will never find after I finish using it is from this palette right here. This palette, I only used the bronzer in it. I have not used the other eyeshadow shades, which I should probably will play later on. I, I don't even know if they still like show on the on the on the eye, but this bronzer right here, it is the shot. I'm going to take a crease brush. I'm just gonna dip it here and I'm going to apply it to my crease. And when I say crease, I mean all over the eye. <laughs> And I like doing this because it gives me that bronzy look. And that is all I'm going for. So on the lid, I'm going to apply more bronzer. For mascara, I'm going to use the one that I have been loving. Voluminous Lash Paradise. Hold on. There we go. Voluminous Lash Paradise. Oh my god. This baby. It is. It does not weigh a ton. It is. How much does it have? 0.28 ounces. It's just so pretty. It's so pretty. And my lashes, oh, they grow like a mother. Can you see the difference? Because I can see the difference. I have not dipped twice. I dipped once and I did both my eyelashes. Okay, so it's time to take this off of my face. All right, let's take this off, dust it off. <laughs> All right. Oh my God. Let's just take a moment to appreciate what just happened. Bye bye, bake. <laughs> now that our baking is gone, all that I have left to do and all that I do is put in a little bit of bronzer and let's get on going. Actually, no bronzer. I have started to. I'm probably breaking so many rules right now, but this. It is such a warm shade and I love it. And to be honest, I have not put any type of like powder around here. So technically, not breaking the rules, my man, no. <laughs> I'm just pressing it in and pushing it up. a little bit of blush and we're about to be done with this face 
So the one that I have been absolutely loving later, late, <laughs> lately is the Color Harmony blush from Milani in the color Coral Beams because it's such a beautiful peach looking thing. I'm very lightly, barely touching my skin. Oh, beautiful. Que belleza, que belleza. Nope. All right, so, uh, almost done. All right, so we're gonna do, I guess, I'm just gonna take the one from this palette, that one. It's almost all used. It's from the palette, the Master Contour Maybelline. It's real subtle and like bronzy looking. So you can very subtly see the glow. It's real subtle. So we are almost done for the lips. I usually go with either a nude or like with a gloss on top. So for this look, or for today, I'm going to use the Celebrity Skin Jeffree Star Liquid Velour Liquid Lip. Oh my god, the smell. The smell... I like it. It's just... I don't know why it smells like a medicine. Like a berry medicine. I don't know. I mean, no hate whatsoever. I love ugh, the formula. Okay. We can't leave without setting that bitch in. I like to feel very wet and moisturized. <laughs> so this is the final look. guys liked my everyday makeup routine I know I started with like oh it's gonna be on no makeup no makeup but bitch no <laughs> I will definitely do one of those later because I do have like a routine kind of thing that it really I really don't work kind of nothing but I still make sure that I don't look dead so that will probably come up later on in a later video so thank you guys for watching very much and I will see you on my next video adios